Okay, here is a very easy question, not so difficult, very easy and you can answer it if you know what are the different types of data. So the question goes like this, uh, which of the following process measures is discrete? And the options that we have here are cycle time, weight of a product, percentage of profit and number of units. Now in order for you to answer this question, you must know what are the different types of data broadly. I'm sure you know that data is classified as discrete or continuous. Continuous is anything that is on a continuum that is, uh, I simply give this example that when um, you can break that into smaller units and each of the smaller units does make sense, then that is called as a continuous data. Uh, and uh, even a more simpler definition, uh, a rule of thumb could be that um, anything that you measure from a a meter or a gauge that's called as a continuous data and usually anything that we count that falls into a discrete data. So cycle time here for example, how will you measure cycle time using uh, maybe a watch, right? Uh, you're going to measure the timing. Weight of a product you're going to measure using a weighing machine. Profit, right? It's a ratio, right? Profit value can change anywhere between let's say, you know, 1%, 0.1%, all that makes sense to you. On the other hand, the last option, which is the number of units is usually counted. You don't measure the number of units. You count the number of units, right? And uh, the smaller uh, units, when you break it into smaller units, for example, if you have two units and uh, does something like, you know, 2.2 .2 units make sense to you, no, right? Uh, it would only make sense to you if it is either two or three. So obviously the answer to this question is discrete.